Hi guys, welcome to my new YouTube channel. Um, before I crack on with this haul, I just wanted to do a quick introduction because I don't really see the point in filming a separate one. So my name's Alicia, I currently live in Bedfordshire. Um, I'm 30 years old, um, I've just, I say just, he's six months old, but I've just had a little boy, his name is Tommy. Um, so you will see a lot baby themed hauls probably on this channel um but yeah that's about it really i'll probably do a more in-depth get to know me video um but here we go i'm gonna do a home bargains and bnm haul because i went maybe a week ago and i got some really cool bits um that i thought i would save and share with you on here so let's get cracking So let's start with these. So I love an organisation cupboard in my house. So I found these in B&M. I think they were three pounds. You've got a kitchen one. You've got one that says sparkle on it. And you also have one that says tidy on it. So I'm going to do a bit of an organisation um, bit in my kitchen, I think, and my sort of cleaning cupboard, and hopefully put those to good use. Um, I got some of these. These were just very Mrs. Hinch, so I thought in each room I could use these and put the bits I need for each room. Uh, one says freshen up. One, I think, a white one says freshen up and one says cleaning um, you can see that with the pink writing um, so we've got those from B&M as well actually no these are home bargains we'll cut that bit out um, we have a lot of these air fresheners throughout our house they tend to be in our bathrooms on a timer in the the spray um, so I've needed a new one they've all run out I've got two downstairs and then I needed another one so I've got this one which is white vanilla bean I just love these they are expensive so I don't buy them very often but coming into spring summer I want these in the house so I'm carrying on with b &M. coasters everyone needs coasters in their house so I bought these, these were 2 99 um, Going back to the boxes, actually these were £2 each and the others were £3 each so they weren't too bad. Sorry, forgot to give you the prices there. Um, also we needed new mats for our dining room. So I got some of these ones, I think these were 2 99 each as well. They come in packs of two, so we've got six seater table, so I bought three packs. Um, also got the matching coasters to go with that. The grey ones will be for our living room, um, but those were £2.99 for six, so I quite like those as well. I like everything to match. As I said, a lot of things I buy are now going to be baby related. So I got Tommy some sensory balls, which have different bits inside, and then once you knock them, they have a light as well. So really looking forward to when he can sort of grab and play with those. For Easter, I've started doing a bit of a collection of um, presents for him. So I saw these in b and I think they were one ninety nine. I'll have to check on their website and let you know. Um, but they're rolled dull, so I thought they were quite nice. Um, so you've got rolled dull opposites and then rolled dull colours. Um, so I'm going to put those coming up from Home Bargains. You'll see all my Easter stuff there as well. But I thought I'd whack them in just as a little gift to him. Not that he'll know, but since having a baby, I like to celebrate all the occasions. Valentine's, Easter anything I'll celebrate it. Um, I got him a blanket which has a shark 
So he put him in at the top and then it's a shark all the way down. I just thought that was cute when you don't want to fully wrap him up in a blanket. And that was $4.99. And then he loves the rattles at the moment. He has a red and yellow one downstairs. Um, so I saw it in the other colourway. So I thought I'd pick it up. Um, he can never have too many toys in my opinion. I think that's actually it from B&M. So let me just put these bits back away and then we'll move on to home bargain. Also, if you are wondering why there's music in the background, I don't know why, I'm just really paranoid that people can hear me. So I think having music on in the background is just making me feel less nervous. So do excuse me when I watch this back and if it doesn't sound right, I will just refilm this. But I just thought I'd explain that to you. Um, so the first thing from Home Bargains were these um, sensory balls for Tommy. So when you smash them together, they do light up. Um, he just loves grabbing things at the minute and we're trying to encourage him to do that. So um, these are really good. And also we make little like sensory dens for him. Um, so we put a lot of sort of the lights and things that light up in there. So these are really good. These were only 89p each as well. Definitely recommend going to your local one and getting those. Um, he's currently, I don't think he's teething, but his gums are hurting him at the minute. Um, there's a lot of hand eating. So I picked up some of these newbie water filled teethers that you just pop in your fridge and then can give to him. I can't remember how much these were, but they weren't expensive. So we've already got a couple of these, but you'll soon get to know me. A couple more won't kill him. Um, staple, got toilet bleach. Never had this one before, but I do like this brand. So I thought I'd give this one a go. I've got some baby wipes for Tommy. These ones are really expensive in Tesco's or anywhere else, but in Home Bargains they are £1.49. Um, if you just wanted a little bargain for yourself, then I thoroughly recommend these. These ones have the coconut oil in as well, so I don't think the ones in Tesco's do. I think the only place I've ever found these is Home Bargains, so I thoroughly recommend them. Uh, what else? Do I get a bit of a random purchase I really like these toilet sprays just put one in every toilet so that if anyone wants to freshen up after they've been just give these a few sprays in the toilet I think these were only 99p or something like that I've got citrus fresh and rose bowl I think I got another one somewhere I think I got the blue one which is coastal breeze I think yeah, I really like having these in there. Just when we haven't had the air fresheners, these have been really handy. A bit more actually bought something for me. Our lovely Stafford hair products. And these were only either $1.99 or maybe $2.99. I'll have to check the receipt or online and let you know. But I just thought I'd try these. They're not massive bottles, I think they're 200 millilitres, so I'm going to try them, see what they're like, and if they're not very good, then I didn't spend a lot of money on them, so. Um, Miracle Toilet Cleaner from the Pink Stuff. I love the Pink Stuff. Anything they bring out, I'll try it. Haven't used this yet, because everything's just been sat in the bag waiting for me to film this. And obviously, if you've seen my Instagram the week I had, it wasn't being filmed this past week. I'm literally only filming it now because Adam's downstairs with the baby and he's asleep. Um, we've got some nest decorations for Easter. I've got like the carrots and the chicks as well. So for Easter, like I said, I like to celebrate any occasion. We're gonna dress up the dining table and put these out. I see we. I'm going to dress up the dining table and put all of these bits out and make it very Easter themed. 
and hopefully I'm still on the lookout but I need to get Tommy an Easter outfit but they're all really expensive and for one day I don't think I can warrant paying that so we've got those uh, sticking with the Easter theme and we've got Tommy gift bag it's happy Easter time so I'm going to put all his little Easter bits in there got him a little my Easter basket book don't know how much that was 2 49 I was covering the price I got little um, hanging Easter eggs to put out on the table or around our kitchen I'm not quite sure I haven't actually got all the stuff out to check yet and then I've got tissue paper for his gift bag I love how much effort I put in for a six month old that isn't going to know what I'm doing. Got little rabbits. And little chicks as well. I think these are foam shapes, yeah. You get eight in a pack. So I just thought when I take his photo of him laying on the floor in hopefully an Easter outfit, that I could put those around him and just make it a bit more Easter themed. Um, I got him a rattle from, is it Nubi or Nubby? I've got no idea. Um, I love this brand. I've just got so much from them. I really recommend going to get them. They're not too expensive. I'd, again, I'll have to have a look. I should have looked at all the prices before I came on it, but I didn't. Um, but yeah, I really like these. He has such a collection of rattles and teething bits especially from this brand because um, right now we're just trying to encourage him to get a bit more grabby because he was premature he is a little bit behind um, but I'll explain all that in another video but yeah love this and then lastly a bit squished got some little furry chicks to pop on the table at Easter time so I think these were only maybe a pound, less than a pound, not too sure. Um, but all of this, yeah, I will put a picture up or maybe film our Easter weekend and just let you know um, how it all looked and how it all went. But I think that's going to be it. I think I'm going to refilm the intro to this because I don't think it was very good. I was a bit nervous. But I might take it on to the end of this and then just edit it all about. Um, but yeah, that is all I brought really. I did go to Tesco's in the same trip, um, but I bought a drink and a chocolate bar. And I bought the Stacey Solomon Tap to Tidy book, which I started reading, which is really enjoyable. But apart from that, I think that's all I brought. I say that's it, that was quite a lot. Um, but I hope you enjoyed my first video on YouTube and um, thought it'd just be a nice easy one to do a B&M and Home Bargains little haul because I go there all the time. Um, coming up I think at the moment because of lockdown I don't think doing vlogs is the way to go because we don't go anywhere and I've really got nothing to show you in that form. It's sort of a day in the life, there's not really much we're doing. Some days I don't even get dressed. This is a rarity. Um, so I think what we're going to do going forward, I'm going to do quite specific videos. They'll all have sort of a theme to them. Um, I think I'm going to film my birth story, which is one of them that's been suggested to me. Um, I'll probably do maybe a separate one, sort of being pregnant and giving birth in a pandemic. And then I'm going to do because I've got all his stuff up there because I am filming this in his nursery the his three to six month baby clothes because he's got quite a lot and they've all still got they're all still on hangers and got tags on so I think that'll be a nice little one to do and I can tag all the um, items in the description box for you um, what else was I going to film I've got a lot of rodeo skincare and makeup so I thought I'm going to do two separate videos for those um, but yeah, there's loads of ideas I've got but if you have any ideas of anything you want to see do pop them in the comments below um, I'll also 
try and link anything I can find online in the description box below as well just to help you find it a bit easier um, but yeah I hope you enjoyed it I hope it wasn't too bad because I was really nervous I'm not gonna lie to you I'm sweating um, and I have said um a lot but it's my first one so please do let me off but hopefully I will see you soon and in my next video thank you for watching and have a good weekend